Hey guys, welcome to our CAD CAM channel Knowledge Live. Today in this video, we are going to design this toy which is a field glass. You can see in your screen, this is the model that we are going to design here. Here I will be using mainly the extrude tools and with that I will be using one strong feature which is available in SOLIDWORKS extrude command that is called selection control. Already I have explained about those things. The link is given in the description box. You can go and you can study those video. So let's open a part first. Click on the new. Click on the part and go for OK. Here you can see the by default unit is millimeter gram second. So let it be. First I will select here one plane. I will select here front plane and go for the sketch. And I will start from the center. So from the model itself you can understand it's a symmetrical model so what i'll be doing here i'll make the half portion and i'll go for the mirror command so i'll just go with the center lines i'll make some center line here which is a construction line make it like this and keep the dimension between this two line having the angle which is 60 degree Go for the circle. I'll draw here one circle. I'll be giving the value. Let it be. And I'll draw here one more circle. And I'll be drawing here one more circle. Like this. And I'll go for the slot here. And I'll choose here straight slot. From this point to this point I will make a slot which is like this now I will go for the dimension I will give dimension first this is having the diameter 50 let it be for this we have to give the diameter which is 38 and the distance between these two circle which is 45 and this radius 9 mm and from this origin to this point having the vertical distance which is 14 this is having the diameter 10 now you can see here your sketch is getting fully defined and now i will be selecting here the three point arc i'll start from this point i'll click on this point i'll make an arc like this in the same way i will start from this point to this point which will be quite like this now Click on this arc and this circle, give the relation tangent, again with this arc and this circle, give the relation tangent, go for ok. Now I will be giving the radius for this here, which is 76, so give their radius value 76, in the same way, I will be giving here first the radius which is 38 now I will be giving this and this having the relation tangent the same way this arc and this circle having the relation tangent so as you can see already I have finished the half portions I have drawn everything at a time because I am going to use here the selection contour features. So come out from the sketch, go for extrude and from here from drop down menu I will choose the sketch and I will be choosing here clear selection, I will be choosing this this portion, this portion and this portion. And I'll be extruding here. So give the value 20 and choose here mirror X, mid plane. Just go with the OK. Now I will make this sketch visible. 
I'll go for extrude here and I'll be choosing this as sketch and I'll be giving the extruded length which is 76 and here we'll be giving the dropped angle 6 degree so you can see here 6 here uh, I need to drop it in outward just go with the ok Now you can see here, I'll be going once again for extrude and I'll be choosing this close sketch and reverse the direction and give the extruded height which is 50. Just go with the OK. Again I'll be going for the extrude here and uh, I will choose this as this I'll be choosing as extruded profile here I'll be choosing the mid plane options give their 50 and just go with the ok once again I need to go for extrude command click on the extrude and I want to extrude this circle and I'll be giving the extruded height here first I'll choose here mid plane and here I'll be giving the value which is 57 so give there 57 and just go with this ok now you can see uh, almost we have finished the extruded portions so I will select this face right now click on this face and go for sketch make it normal to the plane and just select a circle here draw a circle there which is having the diameter 60 and give the dimension here 60 go for ok and uh, come out from the sketch give the extruded cut I'll go for this extruded cut and give the depth 6mm just go with the ok in the same way I want to go for sketch to this face and go for ok make it normal to the plane now we need to draw one circle with this center I'll be giving here the diameter 32 just go with the ok in the same way I'll be going for the extruded cut Go for this extruded cut and let it be the value is 6. Go with the OK. Now you can see here the half portion of your model is getting ready. Now you can hide the sketch. I'll change the background. Let it be plain white. Now I will go for the command mirror and I'll choose right plane as symmetricity plane here geometry to pattern you need to keep on and just select this features this feature this feature this feature and this extruded cut and this extruded cut and go with the ok now you can see here your model is almost getting ready here I will add one thing extra I'll go for the fillet and I'll give their fillet uh, value here 1mm and in this I will apply fillet now you can see here your all model is almost getting ready so now you can apply the material and appearance according to your requirement so you can see here your model is getting ready so guys hope you have enjoyed this tutorials do subscribe and hit the bell icon to get more videos on solidworks and other CAD software thanks for watching have a nice day and happy learning